Hey guys, it's Zach here from Daddy's Boy Shop, and today I'm going to be reviewing the 2014 iBag 39 for Boston Skateboards. If you're looking for a board that can do pretty much everything, this board's got your iBag. Ah, blew your mind. This board is 39 inches long, has a width of 10 inches, and has wheelbase options from 30 inches to 30.75 inches. Now, the really cool thing about this board is most boards, when they have drop concave, it comes to an end right about here. On this board, as you can see here, it actually has a deep tub concave. What that means is there's concave at all angles of the board. So if you're downhilling, it's a really nice place to tuck your foot against. And if you're free riding, it's going to lock your feet in really nicely. Now some people might think that this is a downhill and free ride specific board, but this board can actually be used to push as well, seeing as it has drop through mounting and a very deep drop, it puts you very low to the ground, making it very easy to push. This board is also speed stiff and made with maple. If I were going to set up the iBag 39, I would either set it up with some caliber 50 degrees if I'm free riding, or caliber 44s if I want a little bit more stability. And then for wheels, if I'm cruising, I'm probably going to pick some really soft square lift wheels and if I'm free riding I'm just going to pick anything hard if you're sliding. If you like the look and the sound of the iBag 39 but think it's a little bit too big for you make sure to check out its younger brother the iBag 37. So this has been a review of the iBag 39 with Zach from Daddy's Board Shop. If you guys have any questions or concerns make sure to give us a call at 503-281-5123 or email us at help at daddy's Later guys.